We started continuum with the ambition of defining the future of fashion because we feel that the future of fashion is going to be about how we use emerging technologies that are becoming more and more readily accessible. Our design in 12 is the world's first ready-to-wear article of completely 3D printed clothing. For one thing, it's named in 12 after the material it's made out of, which is nylon 12. Nylon 12 is created directly by the 3D printing process, which is SLS, or selective laser sintering. Literally, a laser melts the plastic into the geometry of your design. And so it's possible to create this like almost fabric-like material by doing a geometry that involves lots of interlocking pieces connected by springs. To create the 3D printed fabric, we designed a structure of many small interconnected circles. I wrote code that takes a given curved surface modeled in 3D and calculates the circle packing pattern and the connections between the resulting circles. The circle packing algorithm is not uniform. Instead, it changes with the curvature of the surface, as well as respond to which areas need more support and which areas need more flexibility. The visual and structural design of the bikini are very well integrated with each other. And this is quite similar to some traditional textile creation methods, uh, in particular jacquard. Uh, in a jacquard weave, the exact layout of the threads uh, in the loom is what determines the final pattern and texture of the cloth. Uh, in fact, jacquard looms were the precursors to the very first mechanical computers. So in the beginning, textile production actually gave rise to computation, and now we're trying to use new modern computational methods to create new um, and more interesting textiles. Thank you.